Hi there, this is Rosie from enjoyyoga.com and also rosieandkate.com and my offering to you is all to do with sorting out the neck and shoulders and any tension in the head as a result of sitting at the computer all day. So first thing I wanted to offer you is working with the shoulders so that we can release the back muscles and very simply you can start to roll the shoulders up and around, breathing in as you take the shoulders up, breathing out as you release them down. Going up with the breath and down as you breathe out. Take it slowly so that you're going with the rhythm of your own breath. <sighs> and sighing is optional but highly favourable. So it's a good way to let go of tension, particularly if you've been concentrating really hard. From here you can breathe in, draw the shoulders up. And as you breathe out, release. And again, in and up. Breathing out, release. One more time, breathing in up, breathing out, release. Unless we take ourselves too seriously, have a little wiggle and also a little bit of lip wibbling. So we go, <laughs> great. Okay, so from here we're going to move on to slightly more work on the shoulders, taking the hands to the shoulders, breathing in and as you breathe out, elbows together. Breathe in, take the elbows back. Breathe out, elbows together. Three more in your own time. Breathing out as you bring the elbows forward. Trying to keep the shoulders lifted so that you're really stretching across the middle and upper back. From here, keep the elbows together and then take them up and back. And again, forward, breathing in, up and back. So getting in a little bit deeper, synchronizing the breath and the movement because that's what really makes this yoga. <laughs> Did I say it was going to be yoga, by the way? Sorry, it's yoga. And last one, breathing in up and breathing out, release. Good. Okay, stretch both elbows up and see if you can stretch in opposite directions. So you bring the elbows together, other way. Two more times each side. Stretching across, feeling the stretch in the neck as well as the shoulders. Okay, last one either side. Breathing out, elbows together, breathe in, open up. Great, release, have a little shake. And from here, take your hands in front. Okay, so working with the wrists, and this is really good if you find that your wrists get a little tight from typing. Breathe in one way, breathe out the other way. Breathe in one way, breathe out the other way. Again, in and out, in and out. Now turn the palms, this is a little bit tricky, I'll try and get them in the screen. So you go round, one palm up, one palm down, round, breathing in, stretching on the out breath. So going a little bit deeper as you breathe out. That's it. Good work. And then working with the fingers, just connecting each finger to the thumb. This will also get your brain working. It's like brain gym. That's it. And then making little circles with the thumbs one way and the other. Next finger one way and the other. You'll forget about your shoulders aching if you focus on the fingers. Third finger. Fourth finger. And fifth little finger. Good. Have a little shake. Give those arms a little rest, release them down, feel your shoulders. So one thing you really want to be working with is stopping the shoulders drooping forward like this. And the way to support that is to breathe deeply and then take the shoulders onto the back. I'm trying to show you so you can see my shoulders are level. Um, the, the, the camera doesn't quite show it. Right, there we go, so we're there. And from here, take your arms wide and take one elbow on top of the other. So you're now trying to clasp the hands. If you can get hold of a finger, anything you can get hold of is fine. Alternatively, just make fists with your hands. So you breathe in and you push the elbows forward and away. And then as you breathe out, push them up a little bit further. Again, breathe in, push the elbows forward and away. And as you breathe out, push up a little higher. Breathing out, drop your chin. Breathe in, stretch up. Look up, breathe out, drop your chin. Breathe in, stretch up and look up. Last time, breathing out and breathing in. Release. 
stretch it out and then try the other elbow on top clasp as you can breathe in push the elbows away as you breathe out push them away even further so you're keeping the elbows above shoulder height breathing in stretching forward and up breathing out a little bit further one more time feel the stretch between the shoulder blades and up and breathe in looking up as you breathe out round your back tuck your chin under breathe in open up breathe out drop the chin under last time breathe in open up and breathe out drop the chin under release the arms oh, give them the least little wiggle good so we're with the neck next and then we should be ready to carry on with the day so from here breathe in and as you breathe out drop the chin down try and keep the shoulder blades on the back so keep the shoulders back breathe in lift the head up you can close your eyes to give your brain a little rest or soften them breathe out drop the chin breathe in up so if there's any neck injuries go really gently you don't have to go far but in keeping the shoulders back, you'll help to stretch the sides and the front and the back of the neck better. Good. Bring the head neutral. Breathe in. And breathing out, turn the head to one side. So you're stretching through the opposite side of the neck. Breathe in to centre and breathing out to the other side. You can stay here for a whole in-breath, whole out-breath. One more time, either way. Breathing in. Breathing out. Last one, turning to the side, and out. Okay, going very carefully now, breathing in, head's neutral, so the chin's parallel to the floor. Breathe in, and as you breathe out, tilt the head. So at the moment, I've got right ear to right shoulder, and then breathe in to centre, left ear, left shoulder. Breathe in to centre, right ear, right shoulder. Breathe into centre, breathe out, left ear, left shoulder. Okay, head neutral. Now using your nose as a magic pencil, thank you to Sally Lomas for giving me this little one, start to draw a circle in front of you and only draw the circle as wide as your nose will allow you to. This is very protective of the head and the neck. Breathing out, drawing the chin down, breathing in, head up, and then reverse the moves. Again, breathing deeply and keeping the shoulder blades on the back, keeping the shoulder tips up rather than drooping forward. Come back up. <sighs> Deep breath. And then using our hands, we're just going to calm the neurovascular point so you can gently stroke across the forehead and just allow hmm, any tension to leave your head. Leave your brain. Stroke down the face. You may even want to yawn as a result. <sighs> and then you can tickle all around the head just to wake up the brain. Check that everything is ready to carry on working. And it's not really yoga without an OM, so we're going to use the sound OM three times to zing the face and, and reset the nervous system, the mind. The way you do this is you rub your hands together, get the heat building between the hands, and then we're going to use the sound, so you take the hands from the heart, on over the face, round the back of the head, and back down to the heart, and you may even feel your head tingling as you do it. So let's do it together, deep breath in. close for a minute and dropping your awareness into your heart centre making a commitment again to come from your heart in all that you do in the rest of your day, the rest of your work bringing the focus into the heart centre 
and radiating out from here. Open your eyes.